Hi, welcome to VTeach Academy and in this video we are going to teach you about the addition of integers. Hope you have understood the concept of integers from our last video and in this video we are going to show you the same concept of addition in the form of a few examples. Let us start off with the first example which is 2 plus 3 and we are going to find the result of the same on a number line. So once you have written down a few numbers on the number line, be it negative and positive, you need to first mark the number 2 on the number line. Next you need to move 3 steps towards the right to mark the next number in order to add the integers that's 2 plus 3 which would give you the answer of 5. Since it's a positive number you need to move towards the right and if the question had a negative number then you need to move towards the left. Let's show you the same example in the form of adding a negative number. So in this case the point is 8 plus minus 1. So the first thing you need to do is marking the number 8 on your number line following which you need to move one step towards the left because we are going to add minus 1. If it was minus 5 you need to move 5 steps towards the left. So that's the concept part here. Now 8 moved one step towards the left would actually stop at 7 which is the answer of 8 plus minus 1. So in short if you would like to add a positive integer then you need to move towards the right on your number line while if you would like to add a negative integer then you need to move the desired number of steps to the left on your number line. So this is about this concept of addition of integers. Now let me show you the same in the form of few more examples. So the examples as you can see here are listed here 4 plus 2, 9 plus minus 2, minus 3 plus 4, minus 4 plus minus 2. So all of these are quite different from each other because we are adding positive numbers to negative numbers, negative to negative and so on. So the first example is 4 plus 2 wherein you need to mark 4 move towards the right two steps and wherever you stop would be the answer of this addition. So the answer is 6. The next example is 9 plus minus 2. So as you have already guessed you need to first mark the number 9 on the number line and move two steps towards the left. and the answer is number 7. The third example is minus 3 plus 4. So the first thing you need to do is mark the number minus 3 and move towards the right because we are adding a positive integer to this that's number 4. So once you move 4 steps towards the right we are stopping at number 1 which is the answer of this addition that's minus 3 plus 4 comes down to 1. Now talking about the final example which is minus 4 plus minus 2. So again you need to first mark the number minus 4 on the number line which is on the left area and then move two steps towards the left because this time we are adding a negative integer to another negative integer and the answer comes down to minus 6. So if you notice that when we are adding negative integers that's shown in the example that's minus 2 and minus 2. We actually move towards the left on the number line but when we are adding positive integers like number 2 and number 4 as shown in the examples we actually move towards the right on the number line. So we hope that you have understood the concept of addition of integers and in the next video we are going to teach you about subtractions of integers. Do watch more videos on education on vteachacademy.com. Thank you.